Yo, what's good, y'all? Welcome and welcome back to Billy Ghost Prophetic Vessel. It's your girl, Billy Ghost. And we got a message for you. This sacred resonates and leave the rest behind. This is a Capricorn and Chosen One channel. Hello to all my Capricorns and Chosen Ones. These are timeless readings. So regardless of when you're coming across this reading, months, weeks, days, years from now, is when the Holy Spirit feels like you could be receptive of a message or be a messenger to someone else in his name, okay? so what's the message and also um as i'm doing this reading guys today is a full moon in capricorn so happy full moon my capricorns okay or whatever you have capricorn in your chart i'm going to be uploading a collective full moon in capricorn reading on our zodiac slash collective youtube channel if you would like to check that out you can feel free to subscribe to our zodiac slash collective youtube channel don't want spiritual guidance that link is in the description box okay uh, i might upload these first then that or i might oh, upload that reading first and then these i don't know so if you don't see it over there by the time you go over there be waiting for it okay <laughs> All right, so you guys could be going through something right now. Okay, something's brewing. Okay, so something's on the horizon. Some sort of stand, some some sort of standoff. Now, because this could be past, present, or future information for you, for some of you guys, you're already in this. Okay, for some of you guys, it's already happened. But I, you know, and for some of you, this is future tense. So just be mindful. And, you know, full moons, I mean, different moon phases, period. But black witches love to, the dark witches love to, yeah, explosive events. So y'all just be mindful, okay? Um, Someone is trying to. You may find something out, okay? So, like, nothing serious may happen to you, but you may find something out, okay, about what's, what's been brewing in the background, okay? And this is with someone that you've been having a standoff with. Okay, rather you've been wanting to or not. Like, you know how some people like you just minding your business, you don't want beef because they're jealous of you and they envying you and stuff like that. You know, they won't leave you alone, or they keep trying to bully you, or they keep trying to, you know, provoke you instead of paying attention to their own life because they're so caught up in yours. That's kind of what I'm getting here. Like a like competition vibes, like somebody putting you in competition and you didn't put them in competition, like you okay now of course flip the energies as you see fit capricorn chosen ones yes yeah, could be you that put somebody in the competition okay it's a, the, you know take accountability where you see fit now whatever you guys may be finding out you know could be totally sudden unexpected shattering okay what you've been going through could feel shattering and devastating okay upheaval so let's find out more about that we do have a love offer here charming abundance love confidence generosity attraction strength elegance harmony magic so for some of you guys maybe you have this type of energy coming in whether this is romantic or platonic okay because even when you have a platonic connection oh my gosh can't get enough I have a monitoring spirit over here. Anyways, if it gets too, too much, I know what I'm going to do. But Archangel Michael, please keep suit. Anyway, even if you have a platonic friendship, you still want, um, you know, them to be generous, right? You still want to be able to confide in them. And in order to confide in them, you have to trust them. They have to be loyal, right? You know, so, and that's another thing too. I forgot to mention this in the other reading. It's, it's almost like somebody's mad that you're healing or you're mad that somebody's healing. 
okay this did come out of reverse to buy masculine in reverse i'll keep it um so this is someone who appear may appear this way but they're not so be mindful so somebody could just be trying to come back into your life to use you or if somebody knows that you're supposed to get like uh another love then it's kind of like then it's kind of like oh no we can't let that happen because i want them or da -da 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 -da. and no you know nobody has control over you except god right unapologetically real if you don't like truth Get to step in, honest, candid, unwavering, transparent, sincere, trustworthy, direct, bold, integrity, genuine, fearless, frank, loyal, open, real, authentic. See, this is what a friend is. Those characteristics that I just named, and not just a friend, okay? Some of you guys may need to do a core cutting, release, detach, since this is the full moon in Capricorn. Um, take some time to release some energies, you know? Whatever that may look like for you, take your spiritual baths, you know, clean your space a little bit. Whatever that may look like for you, get rid of things, people, places, and circumstances and habits that don't serve you or at least reduce them. If you can. So what what's, what's, what's going on with something brewing? Lost on this journey. So this is a lost soul. And don't get me wrong. Um... Shit, sometimes I may feel lost. Like, I don't know what, what God is doing. You know, sometimes God may only reveal the next step, not the whole staircase, you know, or the next three steps or whatever the case may be. So that's understandable. But it's almost like this energy, you know how I'm saying God this, God that, right? And I'm on actually on a journey with God. This is somebody, they're a lost soul, but they're lost because they chose the journey with Lucifer. And you choose any type of journey with Lucifer, you're going to be more than lost. Okay, so what what what's going on that something is brewing? What's these explosive events? How this, what's, what's this? Somebody speaking, speaking on you wrong. Yeah, you need the core cutting, bumping heads with somebody. Whether this is a family member, a co-worker, a friend, a family member. Whatever it is, you need to release them. You could also be getting some sort of clarity on something. Okay, you need to put boundaries up. Some of you guys, you, you just need to stop being friends with someone. Or with someone because they're, they're pulling you down. Karma, everything you've done to me, already done to you. Relax. They're already getting their karma. So... Somebody doesn't want to serve their karma, their karmic debt. And I mean, who who does? You know, um, but that doesn't mean you try to put it put it off to somebody else. And that's what it seems like somebody might be trying what's trying to do here. You know, we got a lot of people trying to swap destinies and shit like that. Hidden secret. Okay, so something's brewing, explosive events, hidden secret. What's this hidden secret? What's this hidden secret? What's this hidden secret? You might, so you may find, you may, so remember when we say you, you may find out something, you may find out that somebody did something that was so toxic. J just when somebody that you already possibly knew was toxic, couldn't get any worse. Okay, scam. So what, they scammed, they could have scammed you? Tried to? Whatever they put you through, oh, uh, they could be going through homelessness or about to be. Oh, yeah. They just knocked on my roof. My ceiling. Strong tongue. So, you know you got the gift of prophecy. Speak life over yourself. Okay? Yeah, it's like somebody, because there's life and death in the power of the tongue. And it's like somebody and they crew, they're trying to speak ill over you. 
or unless this is you, flip the energies as you see fit, put yourself inside of the story as you see fit. And if you would like to book a personal reading, you can feel free to do so via the website link that's linked in the description box, downwindspiritualguidance.com. It's the only way to book a reading with us at this time. Okay? So, you know. Yep. But that's what they get for how they treated you, or that's what you get for how you treated someone. Okay? Final messages. Yeah. See, they thought you was a sitting duck. They thought you was gullible. They thought you were, you know, didn't have gifts. They thought you they thought wrong. They didn't think, okay? Or if this was you, you thought wrong. You couldn't think. Yeah, see, this is somebody that's trying to keep you stagnant. Because they're jealous of you, jealous of your success, right? They're just a hater. Or you're a hater. Fail jar spell. They put magic on you, okay? Or this is what you did to try to keep you stuck, to try to bind you, right? So you need to go see a, 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 a light worker, unless you know how to do it yourself. To unbind yourself, cut cords, okay? Yeah, you need to block, permanently block this energy from out your life, okay? And continue to speak life over yourself here. With words that manifest destiny, they must wield their ability with care and wisdom, mindful of the impact of their speech, okay? And um, I'm going to speak life into you all right now. I pray that God blesses each and every one of you that is deserving. I pray that everyone gets what they deserve for the highest good of all. I pray that God blesses not just you, also your bloodlines and the seen and the unseen for those on the better side of karma. Okay, and for those that also may not be on that side of karma, I pray that you guys repent. I pray that you guys serve your karmic debt so that you can be on the better side of karma. We've all had karmic debt to serve, okay? And I speak generational wealth over you and your bloodlines. I speak love, peace, and light over your, you and your bloodlines, okay? I speak the blood of Jesus as a shield of protection over you and your bloodlines for those that God sees fit for, Okay? So keep, keep going. I have my days. In fact, fuck that. Every day is a day for me. Okay. Um, you know, I just think about what I'm grateful for. And then sometimes that don't be working so much, <laughs> you know, so just know that you're not alone. All right, Capricorns and chosen ones. So that's what I got for you. And, um, you already know. You make your own decisions. Peace out. Deuces.